Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my channel. Good morning. Hi. It's 8 a.m. And I need to clean all these dishes up. All of those. So. And plus I need to feed my dog. I slept in today, girl. I slept in today, girl. I have a sore throat. I'm not feeling great. Oh. What this tickle. This little tickle back here. It's driving me crazy. I slept like shite. Did not sleep well at all last night. Oh, terrible, terrible story. Hi, it's Monday. Hi. Welcome to Monday. It is Monday the 26th. I'm gonna chuck some water. I'm gonna do these dishes. I'm gonna feed my dog. I'll see you guys in a little bit once I'm done doing those things. All right, it's a few hours later. I have cleaned. Well, I've done the dishes. They're all just still drying. I don't have a dishwasher. I never really have, honestly, at any house I've ever lived at besides like up my parents' house. But like any house that I've personally have like paid rent or mortgage for, I've never. Um, never had a dishwasher. Anyways, that's random. I just got done drinking and like doing my morning like meditation. It's something that I'm like really trying to implement in my daily routine is like staying off my phone, um, journaling, meditating, and then I drink this lemon water concoction. So it's like, it's lemon water, it's ginger, which I, I'm, I'm, um, I blend it and then mix it with water, but I have some right here. So ginger, lemon, some apple cider vinegar. I do a dash of turmeric or like two dashes of turmeric and one dash of cayenne. These two. And then I'll be honest, it's rare that I ever finish it, the whole thing. Cause it's just like, by the end of it, it's not, I like never, it's like hot, hot, hot. And by the end of it, it's not hot anymore. And then, um, I'm just drinking room temperature lemon water. But I like binge ate like really bad yesterday. As you can see, I'm like super swollen. I woke up feeling super sick because of it. So I'm just trying to like, get things back into gear because I just I really went off the rails yesterday but that happens I'm a binge eater I'm a um I have some patches on this make sure I didn't just move them um I'm a binge eater I've always been that it's like a coping mechanism I guess um but I used to like binge purge like a lot I did that for a long time, and so I don't purge anymore, but I still um, occasionally binge, and so I'm still like working on getting that under control, which for the most part I do have under control. So I'm going to take some pre-workout. I'm gonna go downstairs. I'm gonna do a nice, long, hour-long workout. Well, girl, we did it. We worked out. I'm so proud. Are these gross? Probably. Did you help me? Did you just lick all the sweat off my face? But I'm gonna take a shower now, and then I'm gonna make coffee. I get to make coffee! And oatmeal. All right, I have showered. I've made my coffee here. 
It's so good. It's so good. And then I also made some oatmeal. I'm gonna eat this. And I think I'm gonna post, I have like all of these things need to be posted on Etsy. So I'm posted up at my kitchen table because I like to work on my Etsy store out here because all of like the stuff that I'm posting is in my three seasons room in there on the floor and so I can grab it put it in the basement or like grab it and get it so it's gonna go in the basement and then number it tag it you know how it goes do you I really don't even know how it goes I'm kind of trying to figure this out me too Oh. Out of paper. We're sending out an order. Getting shit done today. Ew. So I've taken, I made a decision. What's going on? What's happening here? All right. Okay, I'm sending out a package. I just packaged it upstairs. I'm printing off the labels right now and stuff. my things keep coming off like this or like this or like this with like this weird that looks like a suit a man in a suit I don't understand I have a few of those so I don't know I just restarted it and noodles here just to Let's try it again. Are you going to print now? Now printing. Noodle, what do you think is going to happen? My feet are frozen right now. Frozen! <gasps> it's printing. Please work. What in tarnation? I don't understand. I got to figure this out. Please work. Please. I don't know how else to fix it and I need to send this out. Please work, sir. Please. Ooh. Beach plum. It's the best flavor. What do you think? She's like, I like the skin. I take the skin and put it here. She's just waiting for it. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna eat. And I burnt my finger on the pan I was cooking the salmon in. Oh yeah, I didn't figure out what was wrong with my printer, so I have to go to my mom's and print that out tomorrow and then get that in the mail. I'll just put it in my mom, mom's mailbox. And then I also, so that means I probably need to buy a new printer. So I'm gonna have to do that. Yeah, so I'm gonna eat. I'm actually, I'm really hungry. Yum. Houston. Houston. <laughs> I don't know.
Okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't even know why the hell I put this on my finger in the first place. But I immediately got stuck. Hi, good morning. It's Tuesday, it's June 27th. Woo! Good morning, guys. <laughs> I just had a panic. I didn't know why I even put that on my finger. I was like, oh, I'm gonna look so cute when I go run errands and I put a ring on. Stop, Michelle. Just stop while you're ahead. Um, yeah, so today's Tuesday. Right, Cody? There's my baby. We are on puppy duty today, so I have to go pick up the puppy. I have to go grocery shopping. I need to go to my mom's and print out that um, shipping label since obviously my printer stopped working yesterday. But I did want to show you something I did on Saturday that like I recorded a little bit, but I didn't um, post it. But I'm going to show you the end result. But I wanted to, I hung this up in here and I like moved all these over and I hung this up. So, there's some footage of that. It's from Wayne's World. Get it? Yes, queen. Yes, queen. I'm pleased with the organization of this closet. It was just literally everything was falling out of here. So I'm really happy about that. Uh, all right, let's go grocery shopping, okay? Can you guys believe it's July 4th? Or going to be July 4th next week? It is so gray. <laughs> really, truly, there's not many places... Um, on this planet that I don't feel comfortable at. Um, like where like I get nervous sweats going to, but this place is one of them. Do I belong? I don't belong. I just need a drywall hanger. The store is always so stuffy and hot. Ugh, it's just like hot. It smells good though. Like cleaners because I'm in this section. I got a light bulb so far. I hate it here. I just want everyone to know I hate Home Depot. I hate it. It's just like very man here and I don't fit in with that strangely enough. I gotta fix this hair. It is bad. I just have too much for these clips. I need those really thick clips for Thickums hair because that's what I have is a lot of it. Thick hair and I have a lot of it. Anyways, I got the things I was looking for, but I was like gonna have a fucking panic attack up in there. For first and foremost, it's so hot. And then secondly, my I'm just so ugly. I just can't believe this is what my face looks like. Um, but secondly, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Uh -oh. I don't know what I'm doing. And then like, I just feel like I'm being stared at because everyone's like, oh my God, there's a female in the building. Anyways, I started to feel panicked, and then I found what I was looking for, and then it got really chaotic. Like, there was so much going on. There was, like, beeping and, like, a lot going on. It's 11-11 right now. Make a wish. I wish to feel comfortable inside Home Depot. Shit. I'm not supposed to tell anybody my wish. I also have something else to say. Um, isn't it... Is anybody, like, we're getting a Costco built... And there's like on every corner in our city, there's like a Costco kiosk of people, like, so you can go and sign up. Look, Costco, where's that? Costco. I mean, this, the hype about this Costco is like, is, is pretty real. And to buy, buy you, we have two other wholesale stores in this tiny town that we live in. So I don't know why we needed a whole third one. Um, and they're like all right next door to each other. Literally, they're all three right next door to each other. There's a Sam's Club, a BJ's, and now we're getting this Costco. But I think it's funny that on every corner, they are trying to push this... There's a, a kiosk to sign up for your early membership. 
I just think it's funny. I don't know why I think it's funny. Just like the hype behind like a wholesale store is funny. But honestly, if there was a Trader Joe's that was getting built here and you needed to have a membership to get into Trader Joe's, I think I would have stopped at a kiosk because that's how much I wanted Trader Joe's. Yeah, I just wanted to talk about the Costco frenzy of 2023. We have made it home and it looks like it's like nighttime here, but literally it's noon. It's just so shitty out. I just can't believe how bad the weather is. This is what I bought today. You guys wanna do a haul? A grocery haul, a grocery haul. We are gonna do a grocery haul, a grocery haul, a grocery haul. We are gonna do a grocery haul. Yeah. All right, let's do it. <laughs> Okay, oh, sorry, um, I started taking things out. I got this, um, I've never tried these before. They have these like take and bake, uh, I go to Meyer, by the way. It's a grocery store here in the Midwest. I'm not sure if it's anywhere else, but it's in the Midwest. I'm in Ohio. Um, but these are like take and bakes, it's a margarita flat. Beef bone broth for my dog's food. If you hear stuff, it's just the puppy. She's going wild. I got some raisins. I love raisins. It's like my favorite snack. So I got regular and golden. I got some banana, some olives. I've been really craving some just regular black olives for my salad recently. So I got some of that. Some two of these, I got two couscous. I love curled couscous. This one's not, this is just couscous. This is curled couscous. I got two, I got, this one is Parmesan and this one is roasted garlic and olive oil. I'm really excited about that. Some clover and alfalfa sprouts. These are my favorite. But here is a spinach and butter. These, I always buy these big things of dates because I put them in my smoothies. Broccoli, just had broccoli. I also got some asparagus. And then I got some mixed nuts. This is like the best mixed nuts if you have a Meyer near you. It has cashews, almonds, Brazil, uh, Brazil nuts, pecans, and pistachios. You guys, let's be nice to each other. And also I went to Home Depot, remember? So I got a bunch of these things. I needed anchor, like drywall anchor things. But um, I got one for 25 pounds, one for 75 pounds, and one's for 35 pounds. I don't really know what I'm hanging up, but I just wanted to have um, enough for other things. And then this right here is for, no. What did you just take? No, that's between glasses. Here. You have so many toys, eat those. Tear them apart, you're allowed to tear them apart. Okay. <laughs> what is going on? This is for my Himalayan salt lamp. I don't know if anyone still uses it, but I still like to use mine. But the light bulb blew out, so I got those. I think that's the right size. I don't know, I might have to take those back. Um, I got some bread. I always get this keto bread. It's like low carb bread. I'm not on keto, but anywhere you can save, right? Veggie, girl. Cold brew popping. They were out of Greek yogurt, the kind I get, so I just got this too good. I like this brand as well, so I just got that. I got this, ooh, this has caffeine in it. And it's strawberry pineapple with caffeine. And I like to put these things, no, 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 no. I like to put these inside um, like soda water because I have one of these soda strings. So I like to make my own soda water and then put this in it because I'm in the bubbles. If you, are sober and you quit drinking alcohol, you love bubbles and you love a good soda water. So this saves a little bit, even though I bought two cases of LaCroix. They were out of the, they've been out of my almond milk, the kind I like. This one's not bad though, it's extra creamy, which is actually really nice and it's good for the, for the creamy. I ran out of blueberries, frozen blueberries, so I bought another little baggie. Remember I've been doing that apple cider vinegar in the morning? Well, this kind's flavored. This is Concord grape and hibiscus, so I think this might actually taste good. These sounded for, um, pretty cool. They're like beans, but they're like crunchy beans. And I got the ranch kind. These are like 
dried strawberries and they are, I don't know if you've ever had a dried strawberry, but they're literally so good. Eggs, ground chicken, salmon, and chicken thighs. And then the last thing I got was a bunch of cleaning supplies. All purpose cleaner, toilet bowl cleaner, wood cleaner and polish. Barkeeper's friend. Oh, anyway, that's all I bought. So, yay. I forgot I got an order from Chewy. I got two things of cat greenies, a thing of cat flea medication. These are more cat treats. And then I got, I'm gonna just try and, like I said, switch Coda's dog food over. So we got a little bag of this to see how we like it. It's raw, you can see. I'm just trying to edit. I'm just trying. I'm about to eat, 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 eat. I was hungry. And this is easy. There's that flatbread I brought today at the grocery store. Let's try it. That tomato did not taste good. Let's just say that. Honestly, it's not bad. I'm drinking a beach plum and I'm gonna start doing some research because my mom and I are going on a hiking trip in like a week and I've done zero for it. So I need to do some research on hiking and then I need to think about packing because this next week is like really busy, ouch. So 